Mr. Speaker, my message to the American people, don't let Congress seal this Wall Street deal. High financial crimes have been committed. Now Congress is being asked to bail out the culprits and to do so at the expense of those who elected us to guard their interests, the people of our country. The normal legislative process that should accompany review of a monumental proposal to bail out Wall Street has been shelved. Yes, shelved. Only a few insiders are doing the dealing. Sounds like insider trading to me. These criminals have so much political power they can shut down the normal legislative process of the highest lawmaking body in this land. All the committees that should be scanning every word of what is being negotiated are benched, and that means the American people are benched too. We are constitutionally sworn to protect and defend this republic against all enemies foreign and domestic. And my friends, there are enemies. We are told we will have a bill, a trillion dollar bill to review soon and have less than 24 hours with no regular hearings to try to vote on this tar baby. The people pushing this deal are the very same ones who were responsible for the implosion on Wall Street. They were fraudulent then and they're fraudulent now. We should say no to this deal. I ask my colleagues to join us at 2 o'clock in HCA to the Capitol to meet with some real experts who've done financial resolutions without putting the burden on the taxpayer. Please join us, HCA, at 2 p.m.